light and dark. A never ending concept, a never ending struggle. We often wonder what it means to be light or dark or somewhere in between. But honestly, I just wonder if we have it all wrong. If they aren't just two halves of the same coin. Because you can't have a shadow without a light to cast it on. And you can't have light without shadow. There must always be a dichotomy between two such things. And never will they ever overlap. check out this whatever's going on over here uh, uh, I don't know well it's a dark and scary place when you're a lone hunter on patrol there are reports that the fallen back at the Cosmodrome are keeping a pretty tight guard on the old Skywatch it could be one of their leaders or it could be something valuable the speaker's asking guardians to look into it. Ah, oh, so this is a mission directly from the speaker, it seems. Oh, by the way, 98% of this is blind to everybody, so have fun with railing me in the... Okay, the Skywatch is just on the other side of the steps. And it's surrounded by fallen. Well, I'm ready if you are. Heading back to the Skywatch. Oh man, hopefully there are no fucking level 40s around. I'd hate for them to you ruin my life. This must have been amazing before the collapse. Thousands of humans boarding the colony ships. Off to build cities beyond. It, it truly was awesome. Up the hill. The building with the radar? That's the Skywatch. help you no but apparently I can help you dot e excuse me y how about yeah yeah no you die uh, that's a skywatch all right I think I'm taking the shining to this hand cannon thing this hand cannon business is good shit huh Who'd have thunk it? I love how the viewers just keep coming and going. Like the ebb and flow of a river. I'm gonna hop back on the sparrow. Speed this up a bit. Get some more experience riding it. And falling. Headshot. Buddy has a shield. Headshot. Look out. Fuck. I'm gonna need you to die. Thank you. Oh, what? Where? I have to help. It's in my nature to help. Come on, come on, Sparrow, go. Go, Sparrow, go. I have to help. No matter the cost. We might have a problem. Go. Go, Arthur. What's going on? Let's do this. I got your back. All right. 
Okay. Oh, sweet. Uh, is that a warlock? Interesting. like to have a fire thing, huh? Back. Just hold out a little longer. Well done. Sweet. Interesting. That hand cannon deals a little more damage. No, it makes no sense doing field equipping, but gotta do what you gotta do. Right back to Skywatch it is. If I could drive my sparrow straight. Huh. Well, that was a fun little detour and from what I can gather these engrams are kind of like a virtual lottery it's like this thing called cryptocurrency we had way back in the day fuck I missed oh fuck this show you a neat little trick I learned from fucking Kate. Oh, that is beautiful. Beautiful fucking golden gun. We're in. This was one of Skywatch's old array stations. A link to the lunar colonies. These are some great solar bullets. Oh. Another darkness area. How mysterious. Dead end. Fallen sealed this gate. I can get it open. Okay, Arthur. You open that. Is that reloaded? No. Never is. Fallen really didn't want anybody getting in or out. <sighs> oh, that. That looks healthy. Thank you, Arthur. What is this? Lots of motion ahead. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, so do I. Oh, what the oh, hi. fuck? Fucking goddamn fucking. Okay. Seem to be afraid of a hail of gunfire. 
Okay, if you're not gonna come to me, I'll come to you. I get him. Have a solar grenade. Moderately, moderate to severely terrible. Fuck, god damn it. Fuck, fuck, fuck. More of them? <laughs> Nothing like a good old fucking throwing knife kill. There's a wizard here. You have to kill it. Wizard. The fuck is a wizard? Get out of here. Get out of here. Fuck on out of here, boy. You don't know who you're fighting. I'm the fastest gun in the city. Fucking wizard. You're dead. <laughs> the hive haven't been on Earth in centuries. The darkness could be a lot closer than we think. Uh -huh. We should probably get moving. Take that. <laughs> Nothing a couple solar rounds can't solve, especially if you're allergic to life. Ah, oh, what a beautiful day. Sweet. Alright, let's head on back to the tower. I'm sure the, uh, speaker <laughs> needs to ha we We need to have a word with the speaker. That's, that's what's going on in this chrome dome of mine but first I feel like uh, well, that's good what Kate is talking about is actually starting to make sense ooh, ooh. it's got some flame ele elemental damage Cape. 30 over 20 Okay, we're gonna head on over to that tower now. I got... Uh... Uh... What a wonderful day. I keep having people come, come and go. Ah, uh, well, can't always have the, uh, the ye old chat. That makes sense. There was a time when we were much more powerful. But that was long ago. Until it wakes and finds its voice, I am the one who speaks for the traveler. You must have no end of questions, Guardian. In its dying breath, the traveler created the ghosts to seek out those who can wield its light as a weapon. Guardians, to protect us and do what the Traveler itself no longer can. 
What happened to it? I could tell you of the great battle centuries ago. How the traveler was crippled. I could tell you of the power of the darkness, its ancient enemy. There are many tales told throughout the city to frighten children. Lately, those tales have stopped. Now, the children are frightened anyway. The darkness is coming back. We will not survive it this time. Its armies surround us. The Fallen are just the beginning. What can I do? You must push back the darkness. Guardians are fighting on Earth and beyond. Join them. Your ghost will guide you. I only hope he chose wisely. I did. I'm sure of it. We're in this together now. I know Arthur wouldn't have made a bad decision, you know, like, bringing me back to life. It's not like I openly question the legitimacy of the light or and the darkness, this whole dichotomy, this whole dichotomy of fear that you all are pushing, but I digress. Sometimes I want, I'm, I'm starting to wonder if it's all worth it, actually. Huh. And for everyone who's going to be watching this on YouTube later, and by later I mean probably sometime Tuesday or Wednesday, the 27th or 28th of Oct September, yeah, I'm... The city and in orbit of places is where I break character and talk and chat with the audience on Twitch. Feel free to follow or come say out but the schedule kind of doesn't exist so if you catch me you do if not although most likely most case high end scenario it's gonna be sometime late at nights oh and I seem to have forgotten something on my mission dear postmaster what did I forget I I lost it I almost forgot an engram oh my god I would have been very upset. These engrams were All right, Rahul. Wear it well. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha. Ooh. That's a blue. The challenge. Oh my god, that requires level 12. Oh man. Kills with the Okay. Cannot equip that. Okay, level 12 seems to be the next place for me to go for some dank ass I, loot I knew I could never return I did huh. so we're talking with Zavala all right Zavala right what you got that's, that's better Okay, well, that's the one that's better. Level seven. Oh, you got some arm gear. I need to hear something good. Anything. Hello, Ikora. Anything you need? Alright, so we're awakening Rasputin to our cause, I guess. That seems to be what we're doing. We'll go to the moon some other time. The moon's a cool place. 
but they say it gets cooler. You're bundled up now, but wait till you get older. <laughs>